This play becomes known as the Hail Mary Pass. Does everybody know this? You know that you've all heard the term Hail Mary. Now, many people say that it's only used as, well, that's just the jargon. Uh, that's just a nickname that they gave it. It doesn't mean anything. Well, Roger Staubach said differently. Let me give you a little, and Charles knows this, a little biography on Roger Staubach. In 2017, President Trump gave him the Lifetime Presidential Medal of Freedom Award um, for his accomplishments, not only in sports, but after his sports career. Roger Staubach was born a child of a pair of very devout practicing Catholics. He went to a Catholic school. He was very devoted to Our Lady. He entered the United States Naval Academy in 1960. He graduated the Naval Academy in 1965. He went to Mass every day. In 1965, rather, he was drafted in the first round of the NFL draft by the uh, Dallas Cowboys. Rather than go uh, to take a deferment, which he was offered, he did the heroic thing, what any gentleman would do. He did his two years of active duty service in the United States Navy, served a year in the, uh, the Naval Reserves, and then in 1969, he finally went to Dallas and began training to become a professional football player. He wouldn't play professional football as a starter until 1971, and then you see how his career went in 1975. Roger Staubach was and remains a, de a, a devout Roman Catholic. He still lives in Dallas, Texas. He was going to Mass daily. And I want to tell you what he said about this particular play. A few, a few years ago, while addressing students at a Catholic high school career day in Dallas, Staubach encouraged those parents, those present, to remain strong in the faith through any adversity. He said this, quote,